Hey everyone, this is a little uh, tip from Tabular Lex. If you're using Linux, I'm sure you could do the same thing on Mac or Windows, but if you're using Linux and you want to um, extract case names from a PDF, uh, here's something that might be of use. So let's uh, have a look here, for example. I've got a PDF that's 280 pages long. It's got loads and loads of uh, cases and must be uh, possibly in in the hundreds of cases and I could just go through uh, and just look up cases like this so oh, here's a case copy paste but that's going to be rather tiresome so here's what I suggest if you want to find a case in a usual text search you're just going to use the find function and you go space v space and that's going to take you to wherever there is a case because very, it's very rare to see space v space if it's not in the middle of a case. So you, you can fairly estimate that pretty much wherever there's space v space you're going to find a case. So let us use the power of grep. So uh, we've got the we've got a file here mll217xs1.pdf so what you do is you just type in just for demonstration purposes, you type in PDF grep r. You, know, you don't strictly need it, but PDF grep, and then the string in uh, enclosed in double uh, double quotation marks space v space, and then the name of the file. And lo and behold, it'll bring up all the lines where you have the cases. And then, if you're using Linux, then what you want to do is just do this: run the same command with uh, the uh, right. Um, basically a right arrow to dump the output into a text file of your choice. So cases, in this case, cases underscore PDF grep dot text did that and I'll take you to, um, sorry, I'll take you to the folder, I'll just cancel this and open up Nautilus. So we've got cases PDF grep dot text uh, yeah, it's already open somewhere else. But as you can see, it's got all of the lines where the cases are. Now, you still have to do a whole lot of cleaning up uh, because it just brings the line and so it might miss out a case here and there. And so that's what I'm doing at the moment, just uh, working through. So you can see here in, in this line, it's it's got it perfectly. This line, it's got Consolidated Trust Company. Now, I'm not sure if this is the entire case citation. Probably is, but in but just to be sure I will go back to the PDF and look up that particular string but for the most part it does save me a lot of work because now I have a single document that's just got the lines including the cases and for the most part I can just go through do a little bit of tidying up but it means that it won't be long before I've got all the cases from the PDF which is uh, at the moment 18 pages worth with this uh, spacing um, and that definitely saves me a lot of time and effort and probably doesn't uh, doesn't harm my wrists uh, too much either. So anyway, I hope that that is of use to you. Um, I don't have a script for it, but uh, if you want to check out my other scripts, please check out the Pastebin, uh, Clockwork PC Pastebin. There'll be a link below. So anyway, I hope this has helped you. Thanks very much for listening. Uh, feel free to comment down below or uh, leave... Um, or send me a private message if you've got a particular request, and uh, that's it for me. So, see ya. Bye.